Sports. It is a women's bantamweight showdown between Amanda Nunes and Valentina Shevchenko. versus Valentina Shevchenko. And despite the fact that Shevchenko's gone on to win a UFC Women's Flyweight title, this is the fight she wants to get back. Yeah, she wants to get it back because she has not been able to defeat Amanda Nunes just yet. In the first fight, she felt she came on late. In the second fight, she countered a little bit too much. Can she make the necessary adjustments to go at Nunes differently and finally win one of the fights between these two fantastic mixed martial artists? Nice punch, Lance. Lanza glancing right hand upstairs. A couple of chins here being tested early. And again, the jab by Shevchenko. Nice combination there by Shevchenko. Punctuates it with the kick. And if you're going to stand and trade with Shevchenko, oh! Oh, straight right. Nice one, two there. That shot is blocked by Shevchenko. Oh, can you hear the reaction from the crowd as another outside leg kick lands? It's like taking a baseball bat, hitting it up against the wall. You hear the impact of that leg kick. Oh, that's a good strike there by Nunes. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for the Lioness Amanda Nunes. Well, she went to the straight left. Oh, you got unable to a reaction by her there. She catches the kick and works for an immediate takedown with the count. Reactionary takedowns are the best takedowns because you don't have to go and create them. She did exactly that on that takedown after catching the kick. Straight to the body there by Nunes. 
Nice body kick right under the elbow. Back and forth we go! All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you oh, hold oh, Look at that double leg takedown by her there. She's as good with that takedown attempt as any fighter I would think in this division. As good as anybody across any division, across any gender in mixed martial arts. It's a confidence that she has when it comes to that specific takedown attempt. Wow, there is just a viciousness with which she operates here on the ground as she continues to get the ground and pound game going. She might get a finish here. She's looking for a finish. She's so good at dictating these ground changes that she's doing a fantastic job of building posture to try to land that kill shot from the top. Well, working pretty effectively from the top here. Nice ground and pound by Nuno. The horn sounds for the end of round one. Here we go now with our second round, Amanda Nunes. And on the other side, the UFC tested Valentina Shevchenko. Can't take many of those, you better check. All right, so Amanda Nunes getting off here again as usual. Really as well-rounded a fighter as we have in the men's or the women's game here in 2020. Yeah, regardless of gender, right? Regardless of gender, Amanda Nunes stands amongst the best in pound for pound in the entire UFC. Good series of strikes by her there. She is staying wicked busy tonight. Very busy, but also super accurate. She is on point. 71 total strikes have already landed for Amanda Nunes. Well, more often than not, you see when the strike has been thrown, it has found the home. 52% the accuracy rate against Valentina Shevchenko. She's starting to put together some significant body work here, and these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, big kick for her there. Oh! There's no give on that leg kick. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? stoppage by the referee. She was not effectively defending herself, and the opponent was doing some real damage. It became a dangerous situation. I think it's the right call by the official, and she will live to fight another day. Well, she had it all going here tonight as she gets the victory by TKO. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. We send it inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 17 seconds of round number two. Declare the winner by TKO. There she is, big win by TKO tonight, and really everything she said to us in our fighter meeting on Thursday came to fruition here on Fight. Oh yeah, she made it happen. She willed it into existence. Anyone that would listen to her, she told him, I am going to finish this fight by TKO. She got that exact finish tonight, exactly what she wanted. She got two 